Today's Gospel, Thursday, March 21, is taken from St. John chapter 8, verses 51 to 59. Jesus said to the Jews, Amen, Amen, I say to you, Whoever keeps my word will never see death. So the Jews said to him, Now we are sure that you are possessed. Abraham died, as did the prophets. Yet you say, Whoever keeps my word will never taste death. Are you greater than our father Abraham who died, or the prophets who died? Who do you make yourself out to be? Jesus answered, If I glorify myself, my glory is worth nothing. But it is my Father who glorifies me, of whom you say, He is our God. You do not know Him, but I know Him. And if I should say that I do not know Him, I would be like you, a liar. But I do know Him, and I keep His word. Abraham Your father rejoiced to see my day. He saw it and was glad. So the Jews said to him, You are not yet fifty years old and you have seen Abraham? Jesus said to them, Amen, amen, I say to you, Before Abraham came to be, I am. So they picked up stones to throw at him, but Jesus hid and went out of the temple area. The Gospel of the Lord. Today's faithful reflection is from Brother Louis Pangolayan from STCJP. Love at the beginning of time. The divinity of Jesus Christ is emphasized in today's Gospel reading. Christ said, Amen, Amen, I say to you, before Abraham came to be, I am from John chapter 8 verse 58. Jesus was there at the beginning of time. He is the creator and Abraham is part of the creation. In the beginning was the word and the word was with God and the word was God. He was with God in the beginning from John chapter 1 verse 1 to 2. In the 1984 American drum film Birdie starring Matthew Modin and Nicolas Cage, the character portrayed by Modin became mentally ill after they returned from the Vietnam War. He became obsessed to become a bird. He was fascinated with birds even as a young boy. The idea of a man wanting to become a bird out of love for birds is insane. A bird, after all, is a lower form of creature than man. Yet Jesus, the great I Am, out of His great love for us, chose to become man. God the Son becoming man is more startling than a man assuming the form of a bird or any other animal. It is in the context that we can reflect on how much God loves us. For God so loved the world that He gave His one and only Son, John 3.16. It is God's divine plan for our salvation. He was the appointed Messiah long before Abraham, the Lamb slain from the foundation of the world, Revelations 13 verse 8. God loves us then and now. Let us pray. Dear Jesus, your divinity is matched only by your love for us. Please help me to be more deserving of your love. Let me show it by good works, informed by love and faith. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.